Last week, I got a question from Dan. He's asking me um, how to do that zoom in, zoom out video transition that will give you that fast, energetic, um, seamless kind of way to zoom in to another clip or zoom out to another clip. He actually shared this video and let me show you. Um, there you got that quickly zoom in. Uh, we've got another uh, part over here that zooms out and really takes you uh, straight into the next clip. And I wanna show you two ways on which this can be done inside Premiere using Film Impact Premium Video Transitions. So let's start with the first one. One, I got two beautiful clips by Tom Fisk. I got these on Paxel's videos. And here you got this beautiful drone shot and another underwater scene with a turtle. And let's dive in straight away and use the impact zoom and let's drag it in just drag drop and straight out of the box it'll take you right in so bam drag drop done in a mere second right um but of course i mean we're, we're literally zooming into these rocks area so so i can uh, select the video transition and head over to the FX controls tab. And here you can uh, reposition the actual zoom center and let's let's get it somewhere into the C. So there you go. It's, it's literally getting us into this particular area here as if the turtle was actually swimming right here, right? So, um, and it's zooming in well, we, we, could, we could zoom in more to the head. That would be very attractive. I mean, the head of a person or an animal is always very, very um, an interesting part and an interesting area to zoom into. So let's, let's tweak some more and, and really get to the, go straight for the eyes or just, just below or just, just past the eyes. I mean, that, that, that'll help um, to sell the effects. Bam, you're done. Right. So, and this is very, very easy. Drag, drop. Um, this transition has more controls, and and you can dive in uh, and uh, control the zoom amount. You can control the the uh, direction of the zoom. So either zoom in, zoom out. Um, you can change the blur amount. I mean, this the blur really gives that impact, the the, the power. It, it's accentuating the speed. So I would suggest you keep at least some of it in. And of course you can change uh, the exposure to really make your eyes pop and really draw the attention to, uh, the, I, mean, I mean, awaken awaken people well, during the video. So, so there you go. I mean, whew. so, and that's a very powerful way to do this and it's simple, it's easy to use. But we've got another way too. Let me delete this one and go to Impact Warp. Impact Warp is part of Transition Pack 4. Uh, so I'm going to drag drop, see what's done, doing straight out of the box. So you got this fast, curly action kind of thing. And what I like about this video transition is that you can use the surprise button. By the way, we have this beautiful curve graph over here. And this, this, uh, I want to show you this way because it will really um, get you more ways, get you more precise, more control. Uh, as you can see, we've got a lot of more more uh, parameter controls here. Um, but again, the, the the this alone is a great feature that will help you to get that that. Uh, you know, you can change the timing of the video transition. So, so here you got this fast accelerating vibe here and then slowly uh, uh, transitions into the next clip. So um, beautiful here, surprise me. Let's, let's take it for a couple of surprises. And there you can see, we've got a lot of energy in this transition and um, just, Click a couple of times and see if you uh, if you like this uh, particular effect. Let me 
there you go. I mean, it's it might be a little bit too much for this effect, but but of course you can go on and see see if there anything there is that that works for you straight out of the box. Um, but if you want to, let, let's go in depth. Open up the temporal motion controls and the continuous motion controls. Let's reset these and get the values to zero. And there you have a this all. That's this is what you're left with. And now go to the zoom because we want to do the zoom, right? So let's let's zoom in, and uh, it will take us again to to the middle of the uh, frame here. So we could reposition that and and uh, go a little there you go so you've got this zoom but i mean let's let's make it really powerful let let's let's increase the zoom all the way to whatever i mean a thousand wow i mean that's that's the maximum zoom so let's see how that how that works so that's that's pretty pretty interesting uh might be a little bit too much because we have a lot of uh, repeated edges here uh so i mean uh but i let's let's not care let's leave it at a thousand we've got the anchor point positioned right and now what we can do is make a rotation and uh see see what that adds to the uh transition so there you go. So you got a lot of more dynamics. Let's let's increase the motion blur because I I love motion blur. It's 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 giving that energy, right? So there you go. We've got a lot of motion blur there. And now what I like to do because we have a lot of repeated edges and it's somewhat distracting me from the actual transition. And let's dive into the temporal motion controls and let's zoom in here as well. And there you go. Let's let's crank it up to about 400. And there you go. You got a beautiful video transition. So that's that's very powerful. There you go. I mean, this is this is it's cutting straight to the action. Uh, the only repeated edge is, we've got is here, but it doesn't. It's it's not distracting. It's it's kind of a fun way. It, it's a playful way to do the transition. And then there you go. Within um, within a couple of clicks, you've got two ways to do these fast forward, you know, high energy, seamless transition right within Premiere. And I see my colleague is messaging me, so um, uh, I'm gonna call this today you know i hope you like this tutorial and uh, like and subscribe and watch out for new video tutorials and if you have any questions i mean you can reach us by twitter email uh, or contact form all right thank you take care